everybody, it's Mama J. And Spectre. We are here with our December giveaway video. Yep. Um, we have quite a few giveaways that we need to kind of touch base with. And um, not only that, but it is January 2nd. So we hope everybody had a wonderful New Year's Eve and a safe New Year's Eve. And we're hoping that um, there are many great things to come for the year 2020. Yeah. You know, so... Um, we are doing our 400 subscriber giveaway. We are at 464 though. Um, again, thanks to some amazing channels that have helped us get there. Uh, Beard of Pop being one of them, he was truly amazing at helping us. And I've had many other channels help me throughout um, the year. Uh, I can start naming them, but I don't want to leave anybody out. Uh, some of the ones that helped us really jump we're like the Luau, DJ Funko, uh, Homespun Geek, and there were many others who shouted us out, and many others who helped us get to where we are today. Yep. I think we grew pretty quick, and I'm hoping that in 2020 we continue to grow and continue to do amazing things. Uh, we are going to do some new things with our channel starting uh, next month, or this month actually, since it's January, when we do giveaway videos like the big giveaway into the month video. Uh, we're going to do live streams. Uh, it'll give us a chance to interact with you guys more and everything like that also. So that will help us out. And we will do other live streams. We will also hopefully be able to collaborate maybe with another channel here and there and do like mystery challenges, mystery box challenges and stuff for fun. So we'll see how that goes. Um, so we're going to do our giveaways we're going to go down a very long list so in between we will of course do some talking and stuff <laughs> so let's go ahead and start with our 400 subscriber giveaway and for the 400 subscriber giveaway video all you had to do was put a comment on that video and you were going to win the mtv moon person which i was very excited about this pop when i seen that it was coming out I couldn't wait to get this pop. Funny story is, um, we went to how many stores looking for this pop? Three. Three stores looking for it. When we found it, I bought two, obviously. One for me and one as a giveaway. And the funny thing is, uh, we never found it. So then we stopped at a different store so that I could get some things we needed for the house. And I said, oh, let's walk over and take a look and see what they have. And there's at the MTV Moon Person Pop. <laughs> so we could have started there. Not only that, but, um, you know, it, it's just, it's funny. Because, like I said, I, I didn't expect um, to find it there, to be honest. And they were in pretty decent shape. <laughs> so that was a plus. Right so, right. yeah. So we're going to do the 400 subscriber giveaway first. All you had to do was put any comment on that original video. So we're going to pull up the video and we're going to run the random comment picker and see who's the winner of the MTV Moon person. And we have 53 comments. Wow, 53. That's pretty good. And the winner is Michael and Tina Brees. Okay. Nice to watch you both. So Michael and Tina, all you have to do is hit me up on Instagram. Um, again, all winners must be in the U.S. If you're not in the U.S., we will pay up to a certain portion of shipping and you can pay the difference or you can gift it to somebody in the U.S. or we can read y'all. It's your choice. Um, yeah. so Michael and Tina, all you have to do is hit me up on Instagram. Uh, today being the second, I'm going to give everybody one week to hit me up. So you'll have seven days um, to reach out to me on Instagram so we can get your wins shipped out to you. So let's get Michael and Tina's name on this pop. Okay, so we now have done that. Um, and then as you guys know, every month I like to shout out some channels, try to help some people get some subscribers. I had multiple channels that um, we did this month, six channels. I usually try to hit at least six channels. And again... If there's a new channel out there, if you're a new channel, if you know a new channel, send me a message on Instagram. I will gladly go watch their videos and I have no problem shouting out other channels. We've done it before. Um, 
there's channels I've picked that other people have suggested to me and I have really enjoyed those channels. So we will continue to do that. So this month for December, we shouted out six channels. The channels that we shouted out were the Funko Hunter, uh, Funko Illuminati, DJ Funko Pop Hunter, Campbell's Collecting, Potter Pop Hunter, and of course, the Send In. So we shouted out those six channels. We asked you guys to go over to a certain video, put a hashtag, and then we would pick a winner. And the winner was going to win the Santa Claus with Lights, which we have in our collection. We actually have both of them because yeah. it is um, two different pops. These two right here. And we do have them for our collection because this has always been one of our favorite Christmas movies. Um, all of them, actually. <laughs> They're very cute movies. Um, so let's go ahead. We're going to put all six channels on a wheel. We're going to spin that wheel, and we're going to see which channel's video that we're going to go to. That's why you had to go to all the videos. So let's go ahead and spin that wheel, Spectre. And spin it. Alright, so we picked the send in. That's where the wheel landed. You see me look over there because that's where the computer is actually at. Um, like when we do lives, obviously we're going to have to readjust ourselves for the way we're sitting. Um, so we're going to go to the send in's video. And again, you had to put Mama J hashtag Mama J said ho ho, hashtag Spectre says ho ho, or hashtag Mama J and Spectre say ho ho. Any one of those hashtags were going to be okay, but it has to have one of those three hashtags. So let's go to the video that we picked by Sin and see who the winner is. All right, so we have 19 comments that have a hashtag. And it's Wanda Flanagan. Great video. and has all three hashtags. All right, Wanda. So you put all the hashtags. So you definitely are the winner of the Santa with lights. So again... Hit me up on Instagram. Same rules apply. Must be in the U.S. If not, we can work something out. So, um, again, and for everybody who doesn't know, my Instagram will be listed below. Um, and you can just hit me up on there and let me know which pop you want so that I can match it to my list. Because <laughs> I will have a list. Okay, so before we move on, um, a couple things. Um, Elizabeth Mazak did a Instagram post asking people to help get uh, DJ Funko Hunter Dave uh, to 560. The reason she picked 560 even though he was shooting for 550 was because you know numbers fluctuate so much and we wanted to make sure that he stuck at that 550. So she went ahead and did um, an Instagram post. I reposted it. Um, I'm not sure if anybody else did but we asked people to go over and hashtag a certain video that was picked in that post which was the supply drop I think the Walking Dead supply drop video is what it was called and if we got him to 560 we were gonna do a bonus giveaway now she's gonna buy the winner a pop of their choice obviously a common pop at a reasonable price you can't buy you a five thousand dollar pop um, otherwise we would all been fighting for that so obviously you know a common basic priced pop um, you will contact her you can discuss the details with her um, we did get him to 562 which is quite amazing he got his 550 and above so um, and again her winner must be in the US I would say the cutoff um, will be one week to contact her to set that up now we're gonna go to that video and we're gonna draw a winner and then we're gonna give you some more details about this so let's go ahead and pull up that video specter and draw the winner. All right, the winner is Popular Opinion. Okay, Cody, you're the winner. So Popular Opinion, you need to reach out to Elizabeth. Um, you just won from me not too long ago. I don't remember on what stream it was, but you did win from me. Um, so you reach out to Elizabeth Mazak and you can set that up with her now the additional info um, let me write Cody's name down so I don't forget <laughs> so uh, 
we have uh, DJ Funko Hunter at um, 562 at the time of filming in this video. We would like him to hit his 600 that he's shooting for. So, that's only 38 away. That's nothing. So here's the deal. If we can get him to 600 in two weeks, so by the 16th of January, yeah. if we can get him to 600 by the 16th of January, then I'm going to do another giveaway for his channel. And I'm going to do a little mystery box kind of Dave themed. Okay, so might have a Star Trek item in it or a Batman item or something like that. So um, we want to get him to his 600. Okay, so by the 16th, if we can get him to the 600, we will do another giveaway for his channel. Okay, uh, now... We're going to show you a few things. We picked up a few things. Um, this actually was a win from my friend uh, Yojay Collects on his stream the other day. I was actually at work and I jumped in on my break and ran over and put the hashtag because they had told me about it and ironically I won. <laughs> so, oh, there's a note. There's we got a letter. It says, congrats, Mama J. Hope the Batman made it to you guys safely. Thanks again for being such an amazing friend and supporter. Hopefully we can collaborate on a video or do a live sometime soon. Keep being awesome, your friend, Yoj. I I think that's kind of funny because we just spoke about yeah. doing lives. And we won this Batman, which is really cool. Quite that's... amazing. He's really awesome. And he was a Hot Topic exclusive. So we want to thank YoJ for that. Um, and uh, again, if you guys aren't subscribed to YoJ, go over and subscribe to him. He has some great videos, some great content. And he truly is an amazing guy. So we will add this one to our collection. Um, we also, I purchased a couple pops from uh, Pop Couple. And, you know, we always get these pops. We went ahead and took them out of the box that say adopted. It's a pop, which I always think are really cute stickers. Yeah. Um, this one was mine. That one was Spectre's. Let's go ahead and open them up. And they came in pop protectors, which was nice. Yeah, it's always nice. Alright, so I got, which I did not have in my collection yet, only a uh, Walmart exclusive, um, Wonder Woman. So, and again, like I said, I purchased this off their um, website that they, or their Instagram where they sell their pops. So I got Wonder Woman because I did not have her. And then I got the Master Roshi pop, which is from Dragon Ball Super. During the Tournament of Power, when he does the strongest Kamehameha. Yeah, because we have a different Master Roshi, right? Not that one. Yeah, we have the basic Master Roshi. So and I knew, I think the sunglasses are different in the other one, right? Uh, yeah, and the original one, he has the red sunglasses, which he normally wears. And Super, he switched it up with yellow. Okay. So that's one that we purchased to add to our collection. So, you know, we now have those three pops to go into our collection. And in case anybody hasn't noticed, I'm more into DC because I really like the Wonder Woman and stuff like that and the bombshell pops and well, except for Venomized. I really like the Venomized pops <laughs> and I know those are Marvel. So, but they're on my side, but they're on his side. <laughs> but the Marvel was the best. Um, so we're going to go ahead and let's see, um, which one do you want to do next Spectre? Let's do the mini mystery challenge. Okay. okay, so we did a mini mystery video. We started the video. We showed you the first little mini mystery that we pulled. And in that video, you had to put hashtag Spectre or hashtag Mama J, depending on who you thought was going to win that challenge. Now, the winner was going to get this little sorter full of mini mysteries. 
and it's not just the ones we opened it's different ones so that there is a little variety for you um surprisingly many mysteries are very heavy. well not heavy but value wise they're usually worth a pretty penny some of them yeah you know so i send you five six mini mysteries i'm not gonna tell you how many's in here but i'm just saying if i was to send you five mini mysteries that's like 20 bucks just in value yeah. it's crazy and some of them We've pulled some that have been worth, what, $17, $20? the highest one I had was the, I think it was the Freddy, and he was like almost 30 or something. He was was like he worth that much? $28. Yeah, I think something. Freddy Krueger might have been one of the higher value ones. And we don't keep a lot of the mini mysteries. We keep a few of them, but they're not what we collect. But we do enjoy opening them and doing the challenge with them because it's always fun. Um but that's why we're going to go ahead and ship these out to the winner of that video. So we're going to finish watching that video right now. And then we will come back and we'll see where we stand. Okay, guys, here we are. We're going to finish shooting our video. And we're going to see who wins this mystery mini challenge. Magoo is here to root me on. Uh, he's here to make sure you don't cheat. Oh, okay. He's here to make sure Spectre don't cheat, right? Remember, hashtag Spectre cheats. Yep. All right, so uh, we each opened one on the prior video that you guys needed to go and hashtag who you thought was going to win. And now we're going to finish opening them up, get some value, and see who actually is the winner. Yep. They heads keep bubbling. Yep. <laughs> all right, uh, go ahead. Let's open another one. Okay, so we went ahead and we took all the plastic off really quick. So Spectre, go ahead and pick one. He was sitting here saying wonder which one in 72 I'm going to get. Every Mystery Mini Challenge we've done, I've gotten a one in 72. Well, I think it's my turn to get the one in 72. So who'd you get in your body bag? I don't know, but I think I may have just gotten a one in 72. Seriously? Nope, I didn't. Oh. Got, got Loki. Loki. Yeah. All right. Felt like me. And he's a little He's a little heavy, heavy because of his horns. This one feels small. And really light. Oh, we got a duplicate. No? Yes? Yeah. No. Well, we got a duplicate, and this is a brand new case, but... All right, so we got a duplicate of that one. This one fills the box. Does it? We have one like that, too. Can you this is a brand new case? Why did you get another one? Got another Loki. Wow. Well, it was a case off a shelf. Maybe somebody mixed them all up. Um, but I got. You got Odin. Odin. Thor and Loki's dad. So, put him in here. Since your Lokis are laying all over the table. Well, not my fault they have big heads. <laughs> Hopefully, we don't get another Loki. Or another double. This one's real small. But we've gotten doubles before in brand new, fresh cases. I think it was the Monster Minis. Remember, we had like three doubles in that one. Yeah. And I got Bruce Banner. Alright. Let's see what I Yeah, don't be trying to mix them up with mine. Oh, this is a big one. Oh, this is a really big one. Oh, I think I got this one. The Hulk? Yep. I think I did. I did. Woohoo! Ah, oh, he's big. Cool. I almost dropped him. He's so big. Look at that one. That one's actually really cool. Look at how big he is. He's the wow. Hulk. I know, but that's awesome. I like that one. Alright, come on, Meek. He's a common, though. All the ones we got duplicates of are comments. Oh, it's the newer one. Oh, it's just one of the little uh, scrapper guys. Can't remember what they were called. Uh, I think I got this one, which is a one in twenty-four. Let's see. I think that's the one. I got. Oh, yep. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's actually. I think his head's broke. It's another one of the ones where the head's the only 
I fixed it. <laughs> He's actually really cool, though. Look at him. He's actually really cool looking. I can't remember his exact name off the top of my head. I don't know, head, but he's like a little fire. But I know he's the guy who kills Thor's sister and destroys Asgard. I don't know, but that's actually a really cool little mystery money there. <clears throat> All right, come on, Meek. All right, last one. And then we got to add him up. I think I have high hopes for myself right now. Oh. And I think I just got a double again. All right, I got Valkyrie. That's cool. He's and a little another Loki. I got another Hulk. Yeah, these ones, the heads, um, I've been kind of wacky on them, but he's actually really cool. But what? Well, so what did we get here? One, two, three, three sets of doubles. Yeah. One, two, three. Yeah, three sets of doubles. But that happened to us before on a brand new fresh case, like I said, with the Monster Minis. All right, so we're going to add these up really quick and see who the winner is. Okay, guys, we are <laughs> back with some value. So let's see here. The Hulk I got, he was worth $5, and I've gotten two of them. And then um, I got Thor. He was also worth $5. And I got Odin, right? Yep. He was worth $4. Um, Heimdall. Heimdall was worth $4. And Surtur? Surtur? Yeah, Surtur. He was worth 10 He was He's actually the coolest looking one, and he was the most valuable one I got. Um, and what did you get? I have also a Thor. $5. 5 I got my two... Uh, can't stand up Loki's. They were seven each. I got Bruce Banner. Uh, Bruce was worth nine. Valkyrie was worth seven. And then my little um, guard dude was worth $13. So I got $33. And I got 48 Magoo, you were supposed to help me win. High five, Magoo. <laughs> All right. Well, again, Spectre has won this mystery mini challenge. So if you commented hashtag Spectre on the original video, you are now going to be entered in the giveaway contest. So we're going to go back to the original video that we're doing, and we're going to run the comment picker. Yep. And see who won the Sorter Full of Mystery Minis, if you picked Spectre's name. Take it away, Future Huss. Big winner! Mwah. Okay, guys, so there you have it. My record continues. <laughs> I cannot win a Mystery Mini Challenge, no matter what. Go thanks that little Red Guard guy. Yeah, no, I know. I, I just, I can't. I don't, uh, we've done, what, three of them now? Three or four, something like that. Yeah, because we've done it. We've done this one. What else did we do? We've done some other ones. Aquaman. We did an Aquaman one. Oh, we did a... Um, horror. Oh, we did do a horror one. Actually, I think we've done more than I thought we did. I think we did, like, I'm actually thinking, like, four or five now. Yeah, actually, now that we're starting to list them off, but we do enjoy them. I do have some more cases of other ones in there um, that I keep stored for us to do, and we will do those. Um, and I gave her every opportunity. He gives me every opportunity every time. So, all right. So, obviously, Spectre won. So, we're going to go to that video. And if you hashtag Spectre, we are going to... I was going to say spin the wheel, but it's not really a wheel. It's a mm -hmm. random comment picker. Yeah. So, so, thank you to the very few of you who... Everyone still, everyone still votes for me, and I really, really appreciate it. And one of these days, I'm not going to let you guys down. <laughs> All right, Spectre. There are 45 comments with the hashtag. 11 of them have an opportunity to win. Wow, only 11? Ooh, that's uh, very good odds for you, though. And the winner is Mitch Hayes. All right, Mitch Hayes, you are the winner of 
The Sword of Full of Many Mysteries. Um, I believe you won from me before, I think. I think I have your address. But again, please hit me up on Instagram just in case and let me get your address and remind me which prize you want. I do have it written down, but you know it's always nice when people can remind me. Okay, so, so far we've done our 400 subscriber giveaway. We've done our six channel shout out giveaway. We did a giveaway for Elizabeth. Um, so again, make sure you're contacting her if you want that giveaway. Now, we had a few other things um, come up. So, this pop here, this is not the actual one, but it's the exact same pop. I won this pop uh, during Ava Rooster's 1,000 subscriber giveaway. Obviously, I already have the pop. <laughs> so, her and I spoke, and we agreed that what we were going to do is we were going to send you over to a video that was listed when we announced this, and you were going to put the correct hashtag, and the hashtag was void, and we were going to pick a new winner for it. And then you're going to contact Ava, which I will list her down below. Same thing with Elizabeth. Everybody will be listed down below. And Ava will send you the pop that I should have won, but I'm forwarding to one of you lucky winners. Because again, I already have the pop and there's no point in me having two of them. No. So I wanted to give that opportunity to somebody else to win that pop. So let's go ahead and go to the video. I believe it was called Special Guest and it has her little sister in it with her. And we're going to see how many hashtags we have. All right, we have 16 comments. That's not bad. So we have 16 people that can win the Void Pop. More people than who could have won the Mystery Mini Challenge. <laughs> That's for sure. And the winner is AR Cross. Oh. Hashtag void. What's up, channel viewers? At this point, 13 likes, 57 views. Are you kidding me? Take a second, hit the like button. It doesn't bite, and you will at least show care enough to watch. Also, subscribe. Anything comment. Very. So <laughs> that was AR Cross. Um, first of all, I'm going to tell you something. His comment is right on. Take a moment, hit the like button. Um, you know, I heard DJ Funko say one day in his video that he hits the like button before he even watches the video. And if you don't like the video, you can always go take the like button off. But we all know that we sit, we watch the video, we forget to hit the like, and we move on. You know, take a second, hit the like button, subscribe. You know, it doesn't cost anything to subscribe. It doesn't cost anything to say, stay subscribed. It doesn't cost anything to hit the like button. Um, and you are showing support to the channels that you're watching, which is wonderful. You know? Yeah, the YouTube it, algorithm with like buttons is changing. And without like buttons, those videos are being put to the very bottom. So let's uh, make sure that we're keeping all the people that we're watching and all the people in our Funko family. Let's smash those like buttons every time you watch a video. I always try to hit the like button, like Dave says, before I even start watching the video. That way I don't forget. You know, because like I said, you watch the video and then you move on to the next video and then you're like, oh, I didn't hit the like button. All right, I'll go back. And you never go back. No one ever goes back. So AR Cross, great comment. Wonderful comment. Hit up Ava Rooster. I will have her linked below and she will ship you out your pop. Okay, so we still have two more items here. And we've not announced how we're giving away either one of them. Well, we did. But if you didn't watch a certain video, you don't know. This one we haven't announced. This one was announced, but was not listed in the title of the video at all. It was for those viewers that truly watched the video. But on top of that, we did make a trip to the mall the other day. And we went to, oh, just brown paper bag. <laughs> um, Everyone's favorite store. We went to Box Lunch. And they were having a special, why did, oh, because there was, I know, some pop sales going on and stuff, and we went and checked out. Unfortunately, where we live, our malls get hit pretty heavy. So there's a lot of people, a lot of traffic, a lot of foot traffic. Um, yeah, Hot Topic was almost empty of pops. Yeah, it was pretty bad. So we did walk down to Box Lunch because we have a Hot Topic and a Box Lunch, what, five stores apart in the yeah, mall? Even five yeah. stores. They're like 
right there on the, you know, I mean, literally you walk out one, walk down a couple stores and boom, you're in the other one. So while we were there, we were looking around and Spectre found a couple pops that he got. You want to show him your pops? Yeah. So the first one is Android 16 from the Cell Saga. He was the one who was very clear that he wanted to kill Goku, but also loved birds. <laughs> okay. That's where he has a little bird on his arm. He does have a little bird on his arm. I didn't even notice that. That's really cool. And the other one is Goku at the 28th World Tournament. This is the final tournament of the Dragon Ball Z um, anime. It's also where Goku meets Oob, who was Boo reincarnated. Wow. There are so many Dragon Ball Pops. Um, this is what, three deep? Three deep, so there's fifth, whoa, what is that, 1030? And I even have some behind Marvel. And then he has his Broly Chase, his failed fusion, the and baseball four. one, and so on. So I probably have like 40 almost yeah, now. We have a lot of Dragon Ball Pops, and I don't even think we have half of them. So, yeah, it's um, collect what you like, but be careful what you collect. <laughs> So, especially if you're trying to complete that. Um, but, since we're on the topic, why don't you go ahead and open a trade that we did. We have an ongoing trade with the send -in. And this is one of the pops that um, he opened. And obviously, he always contacts us first, as I do him on certain pops. And this one was sent over as part of our trade for Spectre. I need to sharpen the knife soon. Sure, I've said that a few times though. Got a little bit of Sin's hair. Oh, Sin sent us some hair. It's probably from his beard. <laughs> Now we can make a clone of Sin. Uh-oh, voodoo doll. Be careful, Sin. Hashtag buy the pants. This one is... Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta. Some of them, their heads look so big. One's all the hair. I guess that's what it is. So he has that. Are they all from the same... Oh, they're all from the same set, huh? Uh, yeah. So, do you have any other ones from that set? You have the one-armed Piccolo, don't you? No. Oh, I thought we did. They only have the one Piccolo, and it's uh, the meditating one up here. Um, I don't have any of those. Oh, okay. Well, you have three now. Yep. And again, there's... I know there's some, like, that aren't shown. Eight in this set. Well, because, like, this guy isn't shown. Oh, that's true. That's weird. There's some that are are not shown like on the backs, like Super Saiyan Two Vegeta is not shown. Yeah, he's not on the back of any of them. I thought, well, maybe just because that's his box, but no. So, but he's number seven oh nine, and they are numbered, uh, but actually it ends at seven oh eight, which is him. So he was probably an added one. Maybe he's is he an exclusive. Yeah, he's a PX preview exclusive, so maybe that's why. Yeah, and I think I do have some that have the same ones on the back. Oh, okay. Not sure which ones. But again, another Dragon Ball pop. Okay, so those three are going into Spectre's collection. All right, so we still have two more pops left. <laughs> um, real quick, uh, we're going to... Actually, by the time you see this, I might have already dropped a video announcing our Patreon and all the different tiers for our Patreon. Um, I've kind of semi-had a Patreon going on for a little bit. I haven't really pushed it or announced it. I mean, it's been listed somewhat in some of the bottom of the videos. Um, we're just going to put a link to the Patreon. You don't have to join. It's not insisting. But everybody that joins, it does all go back to the channel. And there are lots of different tiers and lots of things for you to get out of it. So it's not just going back to the channel. 
we're gonna do a pop a month for some tiers um after you've been a member either a patreon or a supporter because some people don't want to pay on the first so we will also have a supporter link where you can pay through paypal each month or just a one time if you want to just donate one time to help us out um every time that you do whatever tier you fall in if it's a pop tier we're going to send you a pop whether you do it as a patreon or a supporter um we do have with the different tiers based on how many consecutive months you will, um, once you hit that certain thing, which I believe is what, six months? Uh, six months, three, three months, months, four months, two months. Two months. Six months, three months, two months. Um, once you hit those based on what tier you're in, you will also get to pick a shirt um, that we have listed on Teespring and we are going to add a few more shirts. We've been discussing that We have some really good ideas for some shirts um, Maybe even some chase shirts that you can only get at certain times and the funny thing is um, The idea of a chase shirt, I mean, I know a few people have chase shirts and things like that But there was a certain hashtag that we thought was kind of funny that came from Fox Crown so um, once we do actually list that shirt, we will let everybody know and you know, and you can always check them out. But again, um, everything goes back to the channel and it helps us with the giveaways. It helps us with the shipping costs. So everything pretty much goes right back to all of our viewers, which we greatly, greatly appreciate. When we started this four months ago, mm, yeah, I think it's been about four months now, um, we released... We made sure to release <laughs> exactly 100 videos in that four months. That's a lot. Yeah. yeah, we tried to, you know, we wanted to build up people watching us. We wanted to get some content out there. We wanted to get our name out there. And we released exactly 100 videos in that four months for 2019. And surprisingly, we've done way better than I thought. I know when we originally started, I had told Spectre, if we hit 100 by December, I'll be fine with that. Remember me mm. telling you that? I'm almost at 500. Yeah, and at the end of December, we were at like 460, you know. But I did tell him when we first, oh, if we hit 100, I'll be okay with that. You know, and... Go look at some of our older videos. They were shot in the living room. <laughs> in the with corner. With just lighting. a couple TV trays and a towel because yeah. we didn't have the table. We didn't have the setup of the pot. Older camera that we're shooting at 720p. Now we're at 4K. Yeah, video. so, you know, and we keep hoping to make even more updates as we move along. Like we said, we did get a green screen so that we can start doing lives. I know Spectre does lives already because he has this gaming computer thing. Um... You know, so I know he does lives when he does his streaming and stuff, but we got a green screen so we can start doing lives with challenges and events and different things like that. We want the channel to keep growing. So like I said, everything goes back to the channel, goes back to the viewers. We do, I mean, yeah, go watch our videos. We do a mass amount of giveaways. Um, yeah, we're not giving away PSs and we're not giving away Nintendos, uh, but you know, we give away other things and when we get up there with some of those other amazing channels that are up in the 2000s mm -hmm. then we'll talk about it <laughs> i mean like give away cheap games that i have for cards for and stuff like yeah that. we have i know on his channel he has given away what is it called stream something well it's like a little um steam yeah game steam cards. steam i don't game so um a little steam something i did I don't even watch gaming channels, I'm not even going to lie, because I don't know that much about them. I'm very old school, I like my old Atari, my old Nintendo. Yeah, I let her play GTA for all about five minutes and she destroyed my friend's car. But I did go in a, video, a live stream the other day where Madman Magoo was playing a game and it actually looked quite fun. It was like a Sonic game, but he was in a car. The yeah, Sonic Team Racer. Yeah, it actually looked really fun. And... Um, that would be something I'd play. None of these fighting Halo, Grand Theft Auto, none of that. I, I, I want to play the good fun games. <laughs> Maybe one day we'll get a Switch and I can kick your butt in Mario Kart. Well, see, I'd like Mario Kart. So, um, but again, if you're into gaming and you enjoy watching gaming, 
We do sometimes do bonus giveaways on Spectre's channel, which is also linked below. Um, we did do a few giveaways last year during our thing. And, and he also did a charity 24-hour um, stream. So yep. I'm sure he'll do that again this year. Yep, and we're going to do it every year now. Um, this year we didn't do our 12 days of streaming like we've done. I just couldn't get enough games ready for that. Um, but I am doing 2020's channel trailer, which should be dropping in a week. So, you know, again, and once that does drop, we will link it and add it to this channel because they are separate channels. Um, that's his own personal gaming channel. But again, obviously, it is linked to this channel since he's in this channel. Um, this channel was started because I wanted to start it and I really didn't want to sit here and talk to myself even though I'm talking to all of you, but at the original time, I kind of forced him to sit down next to me so that I had somebody to talk to. So now it was he's... me or the cat. Yeah, it was him or one of the cats. So now he's become part of this channel, so he's kind of stuck. Um, <laughs> but that's all right. Now it's in retirement right now. Yeah, <laughs> he got all these wonderful pop songs. So, you know, he benefits from it. Um, okay, so let's move on to the next giveaway. This giveaway... We did during a Ferrera box video, and everybody knows I love, love, love my Ferrera boxes. Um, I talked to the owner, um, owner's wife actually. Um, so, and I've given her some ideas. I kind of threw out there, asked you guys what you guys were looking, you know, maybe to come in future boxes. Um, so I have sent her some suggestions. Hopefully she'll take that into consideration for future boxes. Um, they are a very small company. I know some people have struggled to get their boxes on time. But again, they're not as small as some companies. At least you get your boxes. That, and you will get your boxes from them. Um, but they're not a huge company either. I know that they're run pretty much by a husband and wife. And like I said, I think they do really well. And hopefully their company will continue to grow. I know for a fact, if you have not checked out their website, um, they did drop a 2020 anime box, which has a limited edition fig pin that you can only get through Ferrera for Dragon Ball Z. And it was, it was the Goku uh, Rose. Goku Rose. Um, so obviously, I purchased that box. I'm just waiting for it to come because he's a Dragon Ball fan. And um, it does have other anime stuff in it, but I thought with the exclusive fig pin, because as you all know, we are now fig pin collectors. We don't really purchase. This will be one of our first fig pins purchased on purpose. Yeah. We have got them in other boxes, and I have had them sent to me, um, as you guys have seen in videos that I have opened. So we now have decided we are fig pin um, collectors. But I will say... We did buy those pops from Pop Couple, and I was looking at one of their Instagram posts the other day, and I think the tiny ghosts are really, really cute. But I'm trying to talk, yeah, I'm trying to talk myself into not collecting tiny ghosts. So if you see me start collecting tiny ghosts, we're gonna have to thank Lisa and James for that because we don't have room for tiny ghosts. I know. Because we, we already don't know, have room for the pops. We don't have, and, and just so you guys know, I do collect rock candy, but they are not back here. They're kept in a different location. I actually actually keep them in my bedroom. They're set up on a stand in my bedroom, but I do collect the rock candy. Um, yeah, and I you just, guys don't see what's on top, yeah. and I also have shelves over there. Yeah. So we, I mean, we do have other stuff, but like I said, I, I'm trying to stick with certain ones, trying to limit, you know, because I know, I know, but. You know, like I said, the rock candy, I really enjoy the rock candy, so I do keep those ones in my room, and I only collect certain ones. I don't collect them all, just like with Pops. I'm picky about the ones I collect. Um, but again, you know, the Ferrera box, back to that, is one of my favorite mystery boxes. And I like the fact that they're all different. Like, we all don't get the exact same box. Let's go ahead and go to the Christmas Ferrera box video. And all you had to do was put a comment and tell me what you liked about Christmas. Could be favorite song, favorite food, favorite movie, favorite tradition. All you had to do was put something down and you could win this Santa Claus pop, which we pulled out of that video. Um, 
And this is a really cool pop, but it's not something we collect. I already have my Tim Allen Santa Claus pops. <laughs> so. And I have one R2D2 Christmas pop. Yes. And we have 24 comments. Wow, that's pretty good for not um, really announcing it. It's more than double the chances of uh, winning for the mystery minis. <laughs> He's a little uh, bitter over that, as y'all can tell. Bitter, no. Uh, so the winner is Candyman. Oh, Candyman! I believe you've won from me before. And it's a long one. Uh-oh. Merry Christmas. Ho, ho, ho. Christmas is a season for vacation because I work so much and I always love the Christmas songs wherever. Keep up the awesome work. This is the last comic before my vacation starts. We're about to take off. Have an awesome Christmas, Mama J and Spectre. All right, Candyman, you have won the Santa Claus pop. Um, so hit me up on Instagram. I believe you've won from me before. A couple times. Um, yeah, <laughs> a couple times I think so too. Um, always a great supporter. Always a great supporter um, for everybody. I see him in a lot of lives. I see him make a lot of comments. He's a great supporter. Um, so hit me up on Instagram. And Candyman, we will get you the Peppermint Lane Santa Claus sent out to you. Okay, so Everest. The cutest pop of them all. He needs a home. I really think this pop is just adorable. Um, unfortunately, he just doesn't fit in our collection, but he really is an adorable pop. Um, so somebody will be very, very lucky to get him. Um, he's just, I, I just think he's one of the cutest pops I've seen. So we are going to give him away still. Uh, real quick. Again, we have our 500 subscriber video that we're going to be dropping. Um, we're going to do lots of things for that, lots of things to come for the channel. So please make sure if you're not subscribed that you do subscribe. Hit the bell so you can see when our videos are coming out and not like Spectre hits the bell. Because um, we all know that, you know, he smacks that bell out of my hand. And, you know, I've thought many times about changing the ending to our videos, but everybody really seems to enjoy watching Spectre smack that bell. Um, anyways, uh, so make sure, and then again, if you don't watch our videos till the end, you should, because randomly we add bloopers to the end of our videos. Yeah. Um, so you can see all the funny things, and then there's just sometimes bloopers there that shouldn't be there. <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do with this pop, because he's so cute, we're going to go to our very first video that we ever released. I'm not, uh, honestly, I'm not even sure what video it is. Um, we nope. have released a hundred videos because I know on December 31st, Spectre said to me, Hey, we only have 99 videos released. If we release one more, we can hit a hundred before, um, the end of the year. And I was like, wow, really? So that's why you'll notice that on that day we dropped our Patreon video. So that you guys can see the new Patreon coming for 2020. I thought it was a Patron video. <laughs> he did think it was a Patron video. I said, it's not Patron. Um, and he was like trying to drink my Patron. I'm like, put it back. Anyways, um, so we're going to go to the very first video we ever dropped. I don't remember what it was, so we're going to pull that up and take a look. I don't even know how many comments are on that video. Hopefully there's some comments. Um, and we're going to use the random comment picker and we're going to pick one person from our very first video to win this pop. Right. So hopefully they still watch us. Yeah. All right. Yeah, so let's go figure out what that video was. <laughs> Down. There we go. <laughs> so the first video was Shumi Mystery Box. Oh, really? 8-5. Wow. 8-5. So, so August, September, October, November, December. Yep. Four months. A little over four months. We're about at almost five. And, and how many comments on that video? Three Spectre? comments. Wow, three comments. Okay. So hopefully there are people that still watch us, or at least the winner will be. And let's use the random comment picker and see who wins this adorable Everest pop. It only shows three. Uh, maybe we responded to one. Oh, maybe. Sometimes I think it counts those. Or somebody retracted a comment. Or that. And the winner is lots of toys to see. Comment was love your channel. Oh, lots of toys to see. We won from her once. 
We won the um, It Box. Oh, okay. Remember from Hot uh, Hot Topic, I think it was? I think it was Hot Topic. Maybe yeah. Spencer's? I think it was Hot Topic. I think it's Hot Topic. Yeah. We won the I It Box. For... does Pops. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Um, I would say no, because they're right next to the Hot Topic and the Box awesome. Lunch sure, in our mall. Them. Yeah, right. so I think if they did Pops, we'd be stopping in there, too. So, lots of toys to see. So you've won this pop, just contact us and we will ship it out to you. Uh, she has great videos too. I will link her below. She's an amazing channel. Um, I've been watching her channel for quite a while, actually. Um, I want to say I won like her 500 subscriber giveaway and she's at like 1200 people now or something like that. Um, so her numbers have jumped quite a bit. Um, well, she does want to fires out for you when you had not even 10 subscribers <laughs> that's true that's true uh, and so you said there were three comments on that video who were the three people that commented campbell's collecting wow and peanut butter oh see campbell's collecting and peanut butter were for first in the very first video i only had three comments and they were two of the three that's pretty amazing so all right so lots of toys to see contact me and we will get this pop shipped out to you um again guys we got lots of things coming we're going to do lots of things um if you noticed at the end of last year you got a lot of challenge videos like in a short period i dropped a bunch of them because we're going to start over <laughs> we're going to start over with the numbers i know i was making a comeback and you guys know and i know that i would have caught up to him but we're going to start over for a new year. That actually was a suggestion by another viewer, a fellow YouTuber, um, the Sin Dan himself. Uh, he made a comment that we should start over in the beginning of the year. And he just wants to see you win. He doesn't want to see me win. He just wants to see the right person win. He's got to buy the pants. So again, we will be starting that over. And like I said, lots of things coming. Lots of things coming. So please subscribe. Um, leave your comments down below. Always hit the like button. And don't forget to ring the bell if you want to see what's coming for us in the future. Not like that. There's no bell. I can't. I know. But I do still have that bell. I still do have that bell. Somewhere. <laughs> all right guys so that's it for this video and again with the new year coming we have lots of great things that we're hoping for and we will see you guys in the next video bye don't forget to like comment subscribe and hit the bell